Hi everyone, it's Adam here from AM Web Design and Digital Marketing. Okay, so what we're going to be looking at in this video, I'm just going to go through and show you sort of the power of automization and having some decent software that does a lot of the heavy work when it comes to marketing a business. Okay, now a lot of these, they're not overly expensive or anything like that, but they make life so, so much easier. Okay. Um, so we're going to go through. I'm just going to be doing some work on a company first aid, uh, first aid and safety training based in South Shields. Going to have a look at some social postings, some local marketing, um, some blog writing, and we'll do all this just during this video, so you can see right by using certain softwares, how much easier life can become for you, rather than going in every day and having to do work over and over and over again. So any of the softwares that I do mention probably will have an affiliate program because nearly everything does. There'll be links down below. If they've got an affiliate program, it'll go via the affiliate program. Um, so it just means I'll get a small commission if you choose to use it. Alternatively, it will just be a link to the website. OK, so I don't know I'll, the which ones. It, I can't remember which ones do. Some do, some don't. But the links will be below in the descriptions if you want to go and buy them or try them, some kind of free trials and all sorts of stuff there. But they're all stuff that I use within my business because I like them and I found them really, really easy. OK, so what we're going to do, I'm going to go across. This is the first one. So this is called Locarlo. Um, I'll just bring it up, it might just sign me in automatically. Yep, so you get this, get found by nearby customers with our local SEO tool. So once you sign in, OK, you add your location in, so it links to your Google business profile and it monitors and tells you where you are in the rankings. Now, I've been using this for quite a while, as you can see, um, apart from first day training near me. Uh, the worst ranking I've got is a, a two in the Google Maps. OK, and this comes with loads of great features. So we'll go on every week. It will put on new tasks for you to do. So you come in, create and schedule a Google post. OK, so I'm just going to follow these, what it's telling me to do. I'm going to go and get a Google post, first of all. So I'm going to add picture. So I use Canva. I just realized my screen's too big. There we go. So I use Canva to do this. Um, so I'm signed in. I have the pro version. Just gives you a bit more flexibility. Generally, any images, unless they're a blog post image, I'll do 800 by 800 or 1,000 by 1,000. Just it's square sips to work across everything, so it's a lot easier to then resize, rechange. You can just use it on everything. It's just much, much easier. OK. Um, so I want something. going to go on here. Photos. Um, work. You know, good one straight away. Somebody calling for help in an emergency first aid situation. I'm going to call it emergency. Work. Training. Is that on? And I'll download that. Download it as a JPEG, just because it's smaller. If you I'm not going to do it for this, but if you're uploading images to your blogs and your website, you want to run them all through something called Tiny PNG, um, which is just an optimization. I'm not doing it now, but I will be doing it, so I'll open it. But this one, the little friendly panda here, um, the free version means you can upload up to 20 images, and it does it. I've got the paid version, but all that means is I can upload like a hundred images at a time. So generally the free version does for 99% of my clients, unless they've got a massive amount of images to go on. So I've done the image, you can see it's there, downloaded. So add picture. Okay, so some picture added. And here this has inbuilt AI. And I like the ones these do, although they're sometimes a bit general. Depending on what you're putting in, they do work really well. There you go. Nice little quick learn. Oh, so, 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 so. Work. Okay, so I'm 
That bit there was Grammarly, which again is free, just corrects all your things. Um, I'll just put a link down to that. Uh, first day training. Uh, first day second or second. Happy with that, so yeah. And all I want them to do is book visit. There we go. And I'll send them. to the website first. And okay. dot com. Okay, and I'm going to publish this right now. Schedule post. Complete your task done. Uh, check if you have your brand name and title. And add if now. I know my brand name is first aid safety training. Yeah. Don't know why I press update and it won't make any difference. <laughs> okay. So that's now done. So those two tasks, one of two. So that one's done. What was this one? There we go, I've got a little fanfare. That task is now done. Uh, what I'm going to show you some of the other bits and pieces in here. So you choose your keywords. So I have 10 keywords that you can go in. Okay. You already have verifying this one. So and you can chop and change these. Okay, so I like the ones I've got in there. They're the most my most searched terms. So it helps me rank, make sure. But what I might do, I might have a couple of weeks, I'll change a few out. And just put something else. Okay. Your statistics shows you what's going on, profile views, route directions to the business, how many posts we've added, etc. Okay. The tasks I just showed you there. Your positions. Okay. First day training center. And there, with the help of Locarlo, this is where we're dominating in our area. So that is not bad at all okay and it gives you tips there how to understand it okay uh, where was i so that's position here brings up all your reviews and it provides you with like a a reply so you can go on and it ai generates a reply for you so you loads of times as a review poster and i've got this printed up in our training center so, or they've got it up in their training center. Now, reply templates. So you want to reply to any reviews. This makes the process really, really simple and it writes a unique reply every time. Here, you can start posting more posts. Okay, so that's the one we've just done. So I might go, you know what? And in fact, there it is. I'm going to create a post for, um, so I'm going to do it in a minute in chat GPT because I want it to do a load of social posting, but I'll just do another quick demo. Um, no, we'll come back to that. Okay. And we'll use this to post some more or I'll do it via hero post, which I'll show you. Uh, in here, it will provide audits of what you need. We'll see and checklist. It's saying phone number, service area. I know is correct. Attributes, other properties. I go through these, these tick off every now and then, and citations, you can come around. I use something called Bright Local to check citations. There's obviously a couple of areas I'm going to have to go through and check, and make sure. Yeah, so I think so good. Yep, you go through, get the business listed on a few more, and that all gives you lots more. You can then share your post, your business, and whatever you want on here, okay? So it's a really, really fantastic piece of kit.
Okay. And I think for one business, it's about 20 quid or something like that a month. However, if you imagine this business, they sell places on a course. Minimum cost is £87 per place. So £20 spent, making sure they're at number one. This is an absolute no brainer. OK. So cool. So that's Locarlo. OK, brilliant for looking after your Google My Business. OK. The other one. I use for social media posting, which I'm going to do shortly, is this. This is called Hero Post, and this automates all my social media across all these different things Facebook, Instagram, Discord, I don't use, but my LinkedIn, Pinterest, I send stuff to um, Google My Business, it does it on there as well, but I prefer to use Locarlo for that job. And you can schedule everything, link all your social profiles in there. It's absolutely tons and tons that you can do with this. OK, so I'm going to use this in a moment to show you what we can do for this first aid company. Um, but first of all, I'm going to get some content generated. So for that, one, I need images. So I'll get them from Canva. So I'm going to produce a couple. Um, that there. This is a social media calendar. Um, I'm going to put this up inside my Facebook group so you can access a copy of it. But what I find works really well, have everything that you're going to do planned out. And then you can literally go, right, I'll automate the whole process for the month. Do it. Forget about it. Job's done. And that's what we're sort of looking at in this video. OK, so there, I'll go and get some ideas so chat gpt um i would like for you to create me 15 engaging social media posts that are about basic first aid tips that parents should know to help their child in a first aid emergency or someone they know make the tone of the post conversational and friendly okay so this company is going to be teaching parents it's not going to be a regulated course like all the other training that they do however they're looking to teach parents how to take care of their children in an emergency and also teaching the children what to do in emergencies. So this is a new thing that they're starting. So I'm going to ask chat PT. So there you go. So we'll have a look, see what they said. There you go, that's a bit better. So, there we go. So it's now producing 15 posts for me that I'm going to schedule and use this month. So in this, I'll just go through. I'll do the first one, show you how it works. Um, this is ChatGPT. Depending how you speak to it, depends what it will give you. Okay, so a bit of practice. Uh, but you soon get used to it, and it's a really great bit of kit. Um, don't get me wrong, when I post these, I will rewrite each one a little bit slightly. I'm not going to have a boo-boo, you know, it's going to have a, a, a minor accident or a little cut happens or something like that, because that's not how I would speak as such. Um, but, yeah, and then I'll um, put them in, so I'll show you. So, parent tips, set to first, you know, mm -hmm. cuts and scrapes we're looking at there. So I'm going to go... Find the picture. There you go, little bandage on. And I'm going to take a bit of text from ChatGPT.
I will write this, but it's just for a bit. Okay, and I'm going to share. Download JP. Download. Okay, so that's now going to download that image for me. So I've got my image. I'm then going to come across back to here. I'm going to copy the whole thing. I'm going to go into here. First one I'm going to do, so I'm going to put a posting to Facebook. Okay, it tells me search for the business that I want to post this for. First aid, enter your caption. I have a rumor, I'm pretty sure it's going to make all the difference. Okay, because I watched the one gently with soap, more then apply adhesive bandage. Parent impacts, first aid tips, and safety first. There we go, nice, easy, clear. We can schedule that, so I might go, right, I want that to go out post tomorrow. Um, but I'm not just going to let it post straight away. Upload the picture. There we go. This is what it will look like in here when it posts. Okay, and it's going to, you can set it to repost if you want, depending on what you want. Schedule. Boom, done. Okay, so that's for Facebook. Do the same for Instagram or whichever. Okay. The other thing you can do with this is. Get to publish all. And I'll do this one. See, it brings up everything here. So I'm going to go and do tip two for tomorrow. So let's have a look. Tip two. So I'm going to take that one. Um, publish. I'll put the text in because I'm going to rewrite that in a mo. Tip one. Oops. It took me a little bit, but I found a, an image that I liked finally. Um, Okay, I'm going to share that, download. Okay, so now I've got that, I'm going to upload the image. Okay, so I've got the image there, and I'm going to go through, post it to the first aid page down. Post it to Google as well. LinkedIn. And that LinkedIn profile there. Okay, so it's five there. I'm going to schedule it for tomorrow. Okay, go out. Half past nine. Done. Content successfully. So therefore, that's it. So I can go through now and I can put this on all week long. Okay, you see there I've made a slight error. So I'm going to the schedule. And I'm going to look for all the posts that are going out tomorrow. There it is. Edit that post. Okay, so I'll do the others in a minute. But that's it. Nice and simple. That's that now posted. And you can do a full month's worth. Just download them all from Canva. Get all your pictures. Get all your tips or whatever you're going to be using. Boom. Get them all posted. They're already going out for the month. 
The next bit I'm going to look at is generally in an article, okay, for your blog post. So I use this system here, it's called Koala Writer, and then I also use this one here called Surfer SEO. So I'll sign in to Surfer SEO. Surfer SEO is fantastic, oh, um, optimized, SEO optimized content out there. It also runs systems where it tells you what you can do. See, these are some ones I've written here previously. First day courses, Newcastle. Content score of 90, that is huge, okay. Um, 2,000 words long like, but there's lots of stuff going on in it. Um, but that will be one that will rank First Aid Courses Newcastle as a keyword and generate links back to the business. So that's already published onto the website. Um, however, if you're doing stuff, you can use ChatGPT to tell it what you want. Or the one I like is this, Koala Writer. So I'm going to go for article type and give it a title. Tips. Okay, and this is already basically this uses ChatGPT. It just structures the content. So I'm going to go hey, Alpire English, English, English. Okay. Oh, so set that running. And uh, what will happen? It will bring me back uh, the structure of an article first. And then following that, I'll request it to write the actual article itself. Okay, so it's come back, giving me the structure. All my headlight H2s, frequently asked question, H3s. Okay, so there's all sorts of great stuff there. And then I'm just going to set it. Write this article for me. Okay. And it's just going to generate that article for me. Now, don't go wrong, I won't post this exactly as it is. But what I would do is take this and then run it through here because it's produced a majority of the content. I'll then go, I'll do a, a further training on this because I love this software. And I've ranked really, really well with any articles that I choose to use this for. Um, so this is just brilliant, but it's a, it's a training in itself, so I'll do that. Um, however, Koala Writer, what you would do if you were doing this in ChatGPT, speak to ChatGPT, tell it what you want, get it produce all the H2, H3 headings for you, so can you structure me an article about this? It will then do it. Okay, and then go back to ChatGPT and for each heading, say, can you write me the text 300 words on this part, this part, this part. All this does is this just does it all together for you, just makes it a lot, lot easier. Now, see, rather than me doing them all separate, go through this just absolutely huge. Look how much is on here. And all these link out to elsewhere on my website. So it provides me loads of content for internal links and everything, SEO purposes. Okay, is that the FAQs? Yep, so FAQs, there you go. So it's an absolutely great big article there. I would then create a new blog post image and half a dozen images to go with the post, okay, because it's an important post, it's worth spending a bit of time on. Um, but again, I'll look, I'll look, I'll look. So it comes up. Maybe a good one. Mm -hmm. Go for that, do you like that? Okay, and then I'll come back up to the title. Okay. 
you can see in this case, I've downloaded it, but this time, because it's going to go onto the actual website, we'll come away and put it into the web. Okay, so now we've gone from 137 down to 101. Okay, so it's made it smaller. Um, I'm going to go into And all I would do is I'll do this four times, okay? So for the four weeks of the month or five weeks of the month, depending what month you're in and what you're doing, I would just put it in, plan it out, and schedule all the posts. Um, I generally do it direct from WordPress. Um, you can get software where it will do it. The social hero post does it to WordPress, I believe. I'm sure you can link this to WordPress unless I've removed that now. Um, however, I don't, I prefer to post within the actual website itself, just think it looks a bit better. Okay, so to post it, I'm going to, go, I'm going to click on posts, and I'm going to do add new, come down the song, put in the title first. I will go through and rewrite a lot of this and do all the SEO sort of side of it. I just want to show you. That featured image, that one's in now. I'm going to use first aid tips for parents as the keyword. Um, like I said, I'm going to go through and do all this properly, but I'm not going to show you it on video because it will just take up time. Um, Come to Koala, literally gonna copy that. Like I said, you do need to proofread, rewrite it, jig it about, which I'll do in here. So I'm going to schedule it for tomorrow, so it's not going to publish quite yet. There we go. So we've got a huge, I'll put links in and all of that sort of good stuff. Um, Into those two categories, I've got a picture there, and instead of publishing immediately, we click here. See, I can go right and publish that tomorrow morning. Eleven forty is absolutely fine. Okay. And so done, and now it will schedule. It won't post, so I can come in. But tomorrow at that set time, it will post that article. So with that in mind, you can literally do an article a week, create it either chat GPT or Koala, and then put it out. That's it. So schedule it one a week, every Tuesday, every Friday, whatever day works for you. And you know your content is going out into the big wide world. Okay, with um, WordPress as well, if you install Jetpack, which is a free plugin, what will happen is whenever you publish a post, it will automatically publish that to your Facebook page. OK, so it will tell, go straight to Facebook, say, right, I've just published this. And I think on the premium one you get, it will post a LinkedIn, it will post a lots of other stuff as well. OK, um, I will also take a bit of this article and post that direct in the GP, uh, Google business profile as well to generate a couple of backlinks, post it in Facebook and different things like that. OK. Um, so that's just a general run through of a few different ways to sort of systemize what you're doing. So you can sit down for half a day and you can get all your posts created for you using chat GPT or whatever you want. You can go on the Canva, create all your posts and pictures for you. You can then use either Carlo to post. You can schedule them on Google Business Direct if you wish. 
Um, but you can also use things like Social Hero that allows you to automate it, get everything set up for the full month, boom, and it all takes care of it. Okay, then. So I hope that helps. Um, if you're interested in more tips, more ways to automate your business, jump across to my marketing. Free, it's a free group within Facebook. Uh, marketing is your business. There's giveaways and tips and videos and all sorts in there to help you as well. So just jump across there. I'll put a link down below. Go and check that out. But I hope you found the video useful. Um, and if you like our talk and what I do, join me in the, the marketing group and I'll see you over there. Okay, thanks very much. Bye.